guys, how you doing? So today I'm going to be talking about God protects you. So I have three scriptures that are talking about the subject. The first scripture I'll share with you guys is John 14, verse 6. Jesus answered, I am the way and the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. Jesus is the only way to salvation. He's the only way to to God. He's the only way that you'll ever find happiness in life. Without Jesus, you don't have anything. All you have are these idols that are soulless. Jesus is the only way to true happiness. And along that way, people are going to come at you and they're going to try to make you doubt yourself. Trouble and problems are going to come and they're going to overwhelm you. But Jesus is going to protect you, protect your mind, and protect you from all the schemes and thoughts of the adversary. Because the adversary kills spiritually and physically. He makes those ill to the mind, thinking that they'll never be happy. If he, if the, he can get them to commit suicide, then he will. But Jesus will always protect our minds. He'll always protect us if we just let him. Jesus, in fact, he's the very spirit that prevents us from taking our own life. He's the one that shows us that there's still a way. Even though we don't see a way right now because we're just too overwhelmed by the problems that we're facing right now. But Jesus is the way. He will move your mountains and He will calm your storms. And He will always be there for you. Just remember, Jesus is always there by your side. So don't ever doubt. Alright, second scripture. John 1 verse 45. Philip found Nathanael and told him, We have found the one Moses wrote about the line about whom the prophets also wrote. Jesus of Nazareth, the son of Joseph. When Jesus is being re is being taught around the world and you just want to keep reaching out to people and it gets Jesus keeps reaching more people, you just want to jump for joy. And there's also a time where you have to be steady and you have to be alert. Jesus will always bring you to your breakthrough, but along that way, it's going to get more devastating, and I've said that. But Jesus will be, is contagious, there's no other way to put it. Jesus will be all around the world. The fact, it says that in the last days, this message will be preached around the world before the end shall come. So when Jesus touches somebody and they accept him, Jesus just goes viral. Jesus just goes contagious and changes people's hearts. When they see Jesus in you, they'll just want to they'll just want to accept Jesus as their Lord and Savior. They just want to jump for joy because they found that way that they've been searching for. In that darkness, they've never seen Jesus before because they were too wrapped up in what they did. But they can see Jesus now and they can give their life to Him. They can accept that new life and throw that old life away. And they can just taste that life that Jesus gives. And their heart is beating again. And, a lot, and Jesus revives you. That's why it's called revival. Because when Jesus touches you and you change, that you're revived. But as you go through life, you will make disciples. Don't worry. Jesus has got you. People will be taught and people will be reached. It may not be right away, but that's because Jesus is, re is preparing you. It's not now time for you to go out and share God with the world. Because 
you're still going through some maturity. And Jesus just wants to make sure you're ready. So just trust in him. He's got this. All right. Third and final scripture, John 1, verse 51. He then added, Very truly, I tell you, you will see heaven open, and the angels of God ascending and descending on the Son of Man. Jesus will protect you until the end. As long as you keep coming back to Him, and as long as you keep worshiping, it's not about worship. I mean, it is, but... It's about the heart. It's not about ritual. It's about the heart. And as long as you keep doing what he tells you, you will prevail until the end. It says in the Bible that whoever stays with Jesus until the end will be saved. Jesus will reward you greatly when you get there. For all your hard work. But God will protect you from every single trouble and problem in this world. Anything that your mind doesn't need, Jesus will throw away. He won't, he'll make sure that you're not looking at stuff you shouldn't. And he'll make sure that you're always protected. You don't need to carry a weapon. Jesus is your strength. God can protect you. So if anyone tries to come near you and hurt you, God will act right away. God will per intervene and God will step on the scene. God is amazing. He's been known to do that. He's been known to step on the scene right when things are going bad. He steps in to save you. He steps in to revive you. and He steps in to love you. And that's what he's doing. So just keep praising him and you will get there. Just trust in him. Alright. I hope you got some now, guys. We're going to close in prayer. Thank you, Lord, for giving me this awesome message, Lord. And I thank you, Lord, for protecting my mind, Lord. Lord, please protect them, Lord. And let them know that you are always their protector, Lord. And that you have not given up on them. Also, please let them share the word of your protection and of their salvation that is given by you, Lord. Let them just share that and let people be touched by it, Lord. Lord, please, Lord, protect their minds from the attacks and schemes of the adversary, Lord, like you have mine, Lord. Yes, there will be trouble and things will be taken away from them. They will be broken, but as long as you keep stepping in and as long as they keep coming back to you their hearts will be healed and that and they will always be there with you lord please raise up strong christian leaders lord and let them just see you right now and you're making a way for them right now lord and that you're protecting them through everything they go lord i praise you in your awesome and your glorious and your beautiful name lord you are amazing and you're greatly to be praised amen all right, so guys, remember, I'm just playing simple. This message is given to you by an extraordinary God, but was taught through a plain and simple person. But he is not. He's beautiful, and he's lovely, and he is glorious. And he's protecting you. Don't let the enemy think that he's stepped away from you, because he hasn't. He'll never leave you. See, guys, please like and subscribe. And praise God in the storm. Storms will come, but he'll always protect you through them. So praise him forever. See ya.